Hello, let's do Wordle number 498. And for the arts and crafts theme, many of you suggested paintbrush, which seemed perfect, all uh, 10 letters. Alrighty, what I meant to say is 10 unique letters, and I tried to say two things at once, but we did get a A in place and a yellow T, and we eliminated a bunch of common letters, so. Uh, I wonder if it's an A-T-T-Y word. Uh, batty is gone. Uh, what else would it be? I think maybe Taddy is a word. I'm not sure. Caddy? Hmm. Should I test A-T-T-Y just to see if it's one of those? I would like to know if there's more than one T. So I think if I did test Caddy, that'll give me some good information. So let's try that. Alright, there's one T and it's fourth. Now that's interesting. So what comes between that A and the T? I can't imagine it would be A-O-T. Okay, and it can't end in T-H. Wow, this is a strange word. Could it be something A, something T-A? Or T-O, I guess. We haven't tried the O yet. We haven't tried the E yet, either. Let's see. E-A. I can't do R. O-A, something T-E? Oh, what if it's something A, something T-E? I think that could work well. But what comes between the A and the T? I think I might need to get some letters here, because I'm not thinking of anything, and I'm worried that we're running into some kind of trap, or I'm not going to get enough info, I'm just going to get grays. So, let's see. I want to test E at the end, I want to see if there's an O. Okay, what are the common letters? I definitely want an L, I guess a D and M, O and E. That would be ideal. Ideally, I'd end with E as well. I see model, which doesn't quite fit, but it does use all those letters. I wonder if I can end in mode, but then I missed the L, because I can't do L mode. Um, is something like F L O D E a word or F L O M E? I guess I could just try it. That's not a word. That's not a word. How about glove? Glove's not terrible. It's all new letters. It tests the E at the end. All right, let's try glove. Just an L. Okay, well, I'm thinking A L T A now. I don't know what else comes after that T. But what is that? Malta? Malta's a, a country. <laughs> no. Okay. Um, I'm probably glad that didn't lock in. I know Delta's a word, but not Dalta. I guess it could start with L. It could be L-A something T-A. I mean, again, I, I think the A must be... There must be a second A after that T. We know it's not double T. This is the strangest word. It's tempting to do Delta just to test whether I'm even thinking these L and then the second A are correct. It would all come down to the last guess if I do that, but hmm. I usually like to do that to test multiple options, but right now I can't think of any options, which is frustrating and usually means I just need to think harder, but okay, well, I'm just going to do Delta then, and I'm going to see what this does in terms of the L and the A. Is there nothing better? I can't think of anything better. The L's where I thought it was, but there's not an A at the end, and I doubt it's a double A at the beginning. So that A is just pointing at this, the A in the second spot. Wow, what is this? What comes after that T? Doubt it's a second L. LT what? Alt X. What the heck is this word? We know there's not double T. If it was double L, it would be A L T L. That doesn't make sense to me. LTF, LTJ, LTK, Z, maybe ALTZ? Malts? I think it's malts. I think it has to be malts. Wow, okay. Another loan word. Not malts. Ooh. Oh, it's waltz. Waltz. Oh. Good thing malts didn't uh, lock in there. All right, waltz. <laughs> Got it. Phew. All right. Well, how'd you do today? That Z was sneaky. Uh, yeah, I, pr I maybe could have thought of that earlier, but really, that was that was tough. Uh, how'd you do today? And um, for tomorrow, uh, you probably guessed the theme is Halloween. So two words related to Halloween. I will say that Star of the Triple Devil was one person who suggested that theme. So two words related to Halloween for tomorrow. And of course, if you enjoyed this content, then please subscribe.